Hi guys, I'm here with my Kingsong 18XL and it's time to put some new extra large pedals on this guy. These are rather beat up and as you'll see they're, they are uh, prototypes. So I know that this is not brain surgery and a lot of you guys uh, can just probably skip the rest of this video but you know if you've never done this before it can be helpful to see uh, someone else do it. it. Removes a little bit of the mystery. None of us are born with knowledge or experience on any aspect, so it's always good to see someone else do it. Okay, so I got these from eWheels. So if you buy these, this is what you're gonna get to uh, two of the pedals. I think you might be able to actually buy pedals by themselves if you, you know, were to bend one of your pedals. Uh, so that that's good, but double check on his website. And you also get new uh, pedal rods and the set screws or uh, grub screws. So you get everything you need. All right, the first thing is to remove the set screws with your ally wrench. Sometimes they can be rather tight. Depends if they used any kind of thread lock when they put these in originally. Okay, and then just use a long screwdriver or rod, something similar. And if you haven't bent your pedals, it'll come out pretty easy like this. I don't really need to replace these. But what the heck, old pedal. And new pedal. Same, same basic size, of course, but uh, Look at the little, and the prototype barely had any uh, grip tape. These pedals are great. I have these pedals on my 14S. I don't get any more scraping on them, even though they're much more bigger pedals and this grip tape. I tell you, it's almost too grippy. <laughs> if there could be such a thing. Just because, uh, you know, it's, um, Too grippy because you can't uh, move your your feet very easily sometimes. But I'd rather have some pedals which are too grippy than not grippy enough. Now these new uh, pedals, unlike the old pedals which were threaded on both sides, these are only threaded on one side. And I have to try and ah, it's hard to see. I get a flash flashlight. Okay, so I'm able to see with the flashlight that the threads are on this side.
So, one th Knock it in until it pretty much stops. Won't go any further. And then I can put the, the grub screw in. I'm going to put a little Loctite. Okay, I'm going to put some lock tight on this or thread locker. Just make sure you put the removable type. If you put the non-removable type, they're removable, but uh, it's not going to be fun. have to remove these pedals again. You don't have to remove these pedals to get off the side panels on this wheel, so that's nice. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna thread it until it stops there. That's it. One more pedal to go. All right, well, that was quick. That probably 10 minutes total work to switch out these pedals. And uh, I think these are great. I'm, I was positive they come from E-Wheels on the 18XL. I don't know if Jason is putting these by default on the 16S or the 14S, but if not, I, I don't know. I just think they're, they're really worthwhile getting. They're, they're a substantial improvement over the stock, stock pedals. And uh, highly recommended. So I don't think these are coming with the the new 16s. Apparently they're changing to a a new non non standard uh, pedal bracket. That's unfortunate. All right, guys. See you later.